Sunshine gave way to clouds and we're going to be in for a dreary and damp stretch. I've got four straight days of rain chances, although tomorrow I'm really only talking about patchy drizzle right now. 63 degrees. Our temperature made it to a high of 70 earlier today. Our average high 65 degrees. Currently out in the hill country, it's 63 in Lano, 61 Johnson City, 64 at the airport, and in Carmen, you're also at 64. So temps right now are pretty close to what a typical February afternoon would be. Cold front number one is just to our west. A couple of little spotty areas of drizzle already trying to develop up to our north. This front is going to push through the hill country tomorrow and then probably stall and fizzle. Really not going to bring us much more than a couple hundredths of an inch of rain. This system, on the other hand, will be coming in on Sunday morning. With it, we could see some showers and some thunderstorms. And behind it, we'll finally start to see some cooler weather. So here we go. Patchy drizzle tomorrow, just a 20% chance spotty showers Friday, then 70% chances Saturday morning as well as Sunday morning, and maybe even a couple of rumbles of thunder out there too. For tomorrow, we'll just keep the cloudy skies in place, low of 58 degrees, so starting off mild. Afternoon high all the way up to 74. As warm as that is, it's nowhere close to the record of 87 degrees. Burn it 72 tomorrow, same thing for you in Bastrop, so it's going to be a warm, dreary, and cloudy day. As for that potential drizzle. You can see here by about lunchtime there could be some patches of little spotty shower activity. Here's that front that I talked about and it pretty much dissipates. So that's it. Then we look ahead and at this point there is going to be the potential again of seeing some very patchy light drizzle. One to two to three one hundredths of an inch of rain. Friday, not much more than that with some spotty showers. However, Saturday, if we get some showers and thunderstorms to develop, at least this computer model trying to blossom in a little bit more rain. So let's look at the big picture. Here's your Saturday with a swath of showers. Then we get a break and then Sunday with that second cold front coming through. This would probably be our best bet for rain area wide. Note I said rain. There could actually be some wintry weather farther to the north. And then behind that front by Monday, we see the coolest air of the month so far. High temperature 58 degrees is going to be cool and blustery. That could pave the way for Tuesday 37 in the morning. Perhaps a light freeze in some outlying areas. Valentine's Day, by the way, looking great right now. We'll be right back.